we go. Hello, everyone. It is time once again for Otaku no Cooking. But we're going to make Naruto Rolls, which I believe is a um, nod to a certain anime and manga ninja. And it's probably not the actual Japanese term for it, but it's basically a, a simple sort of appetizer, or simple meal roll. It's going to be very simple and quick, I think. And we're just going to go ahead and make it. So these are going to be basically a combination of ham, cheese, and nori, or seaweed, uh, seaweed sheets, all rolled together. They say it doesn't matter what order they're in, so that's good. So just grab some. Let me grab a sheet here. Oh, actually, well, I cut some off. Something else. Um, let me see what I've got. Let me, uh, let me grab a bigger sheet here. Doesn't want to come out. Now it's going to be a better, better size for the. And I think maybe we'll find out. You say just layer them together. Um, I've never tried this before, food wise. Uh, is that going to be. Yeah, I'm going to need that. So we're just going to layer together ham. Rub some of that uh, ham up. And cheese. Got some cheddar cheese here. Sliced thin, in this case. You don't have to have uh, thin sliced cheese, which is what I happen to have on the hand. And we're going to go a little bit over here. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut this. Like, can you cut nori with a knife? Kind of. Yeah. Yeah, it comes. I need it to be a little uh, firmer with the knife. Okay, and they say basically just roll it. I'm not sure if I should roll it. Hmm. Roll the stack and push it. I'll do it this way. I'll roll the stack. It seems to me there's going to be one way that's better than another. I'm not sure. Rolled that. It doesn't seem very thick. No, I'm going to do it the other way. Just a little, got a little bit of. Okay, I'm going to cut this. It kind of cuts through. Not very well. Okay. I'm going to roll this way instead. Oops, got some. Yeah. And if used, it's rolling. Okay. So it's all rolled together, and they say to use toothpick to hold it in place. There we go. And then cut off the ends to make it even, and then we're going to slice it into smaller pieces. So we're going to do this, and this, to so you even, and then we'll do a roll here. The roll here. So what's interesting about this is that the nori is doing a pretty good job of holding these rolls together. Now, obviously, the cheese is cracked. But as you can see, that's not bad. It's actually just held together. Normally, you just put them up kind of like this. Here's the one I pierced. And if I do that, that, that holds together okay. Now the big question. Hmm. Yeah. The nori is um, nori. You have to get used to the taste of that, which is uh, a little bitter. But not bad. Let's do another one. Pieces off there. Okay. Check for any comments. Oh, one second. Got some computer issues there. There we go. Um, okay, good. So, again, let's just take some. Let's, let's change things around a little bit. Let's try some cheese. Go in this way. Actually, you know what? 
how big how much ham I might do a big one. Are these noise sheets? Oh yeah, okay, that's what I'm missing. Got it. So the reason I'm having issues with the, uh, the size there is because you're supposed to use the entire sheet of noise. So I'm gonna grab some ham. Okay, yeah, this this is making a lot more sense. You don't want to cut the nori down to size, you want to use all your ingredients and fill that sheet of nori. I may have to trim that down a bit. Yeah, I'm going to cut off. Small strip of the ham. Just a little fit. <clears throat> Waste not, want not, want not. Okay. And go there. Move that cheese back in place. This time we have the, oh man, that cheese wants to go with the other ham. There we are. So we have the ham, cheese, nori. And then it shouldn't matter which way I roll. I think I will roll this way so we have a bit more uh, flexibility with that gap there. That's going to, yep. Go. Scoop it. All right. There's our nori. There's our Naruto roll, so to speak. I'm going to cut off the ends. Now I'm going to do some firm cuts. So as you can. Cut those bits. I'm not quite sure what you do with those those bits on the end. Kind of awkward size. Okay. So they are unrolling a little bit. But I think you can more or less squash these back in place. So there are your Naruto rolls. Anyone happen to be coming by? Same idea here. Mm. It's a nice combination. You get the saltiness of the, uh, the ham, and the slight sweetness of the ham, along with the sharpness of the cheddar. It adds a creaminess to it as well. Along with that, that unique nori taste, and I don't mean unique in a negative sense. It's just it is a, it's, it has this almost umami to it, um, but it's not heavy. It's a, it's a very light, easy thing to eat. And the nice thing about this is it should last in the fridge pretty well. So I think we can refrigerate this stuff and use it another time. Um, maybe to work perhaps tomorrow or have it as a lunch. Is, well, what you, you might be able to do is use a little less ham and cheese. So there's a lip of the nori, and then wet the nori. And then when it comes back around, fold that wet nori onto the um, you know, the, the nori uh, on the side of the roll, and that should stick. That might be the way of doing that. Is you have a little extra there. Um, and I'm going to try. There's actually over back here as well. I'm gonna do this. That's yeah, moving the cheese a bit in there. It's sort of a uh, air bubble as I do that. Okay, and I have that, that nori here. So I think if I, so I've got this flap. I'm going to try just wetting down that flap and then holding it onto the, onto the underside. Just hold that. That, what do you know? So that might go on. Let me just see if I can. 
you might want to do this <laughs> before you go to seal it up. But can you, you know, it doesn't want to, it doesn't hold together very well. When you start putting it. Look at that. That is much better. That is that is more like what you'd expect. I mean, there's a few little problems with cutting, but that's pretty good. That's what you do. Let me try re-wetting that. I'm going to use my saliva because I'm the only one that's going to eat this. Does that help? Yeah, that helps. Cool. So we've learned something. He says, wet down your nori, and uh, that's not a euphemism. Use that to seal it down. Cool. So that are, those are Naruto rolls. Next week, we'll, we'll, we'll progress off to something uh, quite a bit more complicated, but... Uh,